Hi, princess. Just got the mail. I am, I did place a Walmart order. I'm gonna do a bougie on a budget video for you guys, but everything is coming in separately, unfortunately. Here's a sneak peek. Oh my God. Oh, finally. This is the last watch band I got for my Apple Watch, which I should probably throw on. This one took forever to come in. So this is the only one that doesn't actually say Gucci on the inside, it just says genuine leather. So it is black leather with the Gucci print. I love this one. I love getting the mail and having no bills. What an awesome, oh, it's Saturday, by the way. Happy weekend. It's absolutely gorgeous here in New England. This is an Ulta order. I have not been buying skincare or makeup or anything like that, but for some reason, I really wanted to try eyeliner. I do such basic makeup now that I thought it would be fun if I did eyeliner. Switch up my look since I'm keeping everything so natural. I feel like eyeliner could give me that little edge. For the items that I did purchase, I grabbed the Lancome, looks like it's a mascara. I think this is a primer. Yep, so I grabbed the Lancome Mascara Primer and then I picked up two different eyeliners. I just wasn't sure which one I would like more. So I grabbed the Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Eyelining Pen and then Kat Von D's um, like vegan line that she just came out with, Tattoo Liner. So it is 10.35 right now. I am heading to my friend's house today, my friend Sarah. I haven't seen her in a while. So she bought a house, she got a new dog, so I wanna see her house, like celebrate her for the day. I had another facial done two days ago, three days ago. My facials consist of extractions. Like she does other things, but my skin is just so bad that extractions take up a majority of my time. I also went to my dermatologist yesterday and I'm a firm believer in dermatologist suck. So she looked at my face for 10 seconds max. She had me leave my mask on the entire time. Um, didn't ask me what I'm using for products. Didn't ask me about what I'm eating. Like did not ask about anything. Literally just looked at my face. And for me, I feel like shouldn't you want to know what the issue is for why my skin looks like this right now when it never has in my entire life? I did decide yesterday that I'm cutting dairy out completely. I'm pretty good. I haven't drank milk in years, but I still do eat soft cheeses. I love the shredded Mexican cheese blend. I put it in everything. So I'm officially dairy free. We are going to a Mexican restaurant tonight. So this will be my ultimate challenge. I'm a creature of habit with Mexican and Chinese food. I always order the same things. My order at Chinese restaurants is chicken broccoli with white rice. No combo meal. I don't add anything extra. I'm so basic with it. I just love that. It's actually what I had for dinner last night. And then at Mexican restaurants, we always get queso just literally a cup of cheese. And then I always get a chimichanga, usually with cheese and queso on top and shredded chicken. So that will not be happening tonight.
I hope you guys don't mind that I'm not putting music in the background of certain parts, maybe this entire video. I haven't figured it out yet. I have been watching Nicole, I don't know how to say her last name, Guerrero, Guerrero, I have no idea. I've been watching her vlogs and I love having vlogs on in the background now when I'm doing just daily things which is probably why I've been filming so many lately is because that's what the kind of content I've been loving to watch and I like them because I'm not learning anything I feel like I'm just hanging out with someone and if I miss something it's not the end of the world it's just not like important information I guess but we're just hanging out so I love her vlogs because she does a lot of or she does know like background music and it's just silence. So she'll be doing her makeup or painting, just doing these like small things and there's no background music. Like you really feel like you're there and you can zen out with her. So let's set this. I can't. I'm gonna go get that mascara primer and try it on on camera for you guys. We love her. Okay, let's go get the mascara. I love that I am filming another video for you guys when I already have three videos filmed and not edited, which means they're not uploaded. And I have a couple hauls behind me. So the start of the Walmart haul, which I told you about in the beginning of this video. And then I'm gonna do an Amazon video. So like if you are attending a wedding still in 2020 and you need a dress, some options that are under $30 or under $20, and I have another Zara haul. So I got a shit ton of content for you guys. Okay, so 24 hour wear with your mascara, 93% saw more length, 92% saw more volume, and 85% saw more curl. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to let it dry down a little bit or like go right in with my next mascara. So I'm probably gonna have to try this a couple different times to see what works best. My baby's home. Callie's running to the door. Okay, here we go. I honestly can't tell a difference compared to how I usually look with mascara on. It does look a little thicker at the base, but longer? No. Yeah, 
Ah, you found me! Oh, she's in here! You found mommy? Hey, get out of here! You being a good girl for mommy? She's been laying in front of the door. Oh. All morning. Your, that's your favorite spot is in front of the door. Okay. Hot and sweaty. Uh, we Hot just sweaty. left lunch at Patriot Place. So Sarah lives like really, really close. If you're not familiar, it's where the Patriots play the football. Go Red Sox. <laughs> so we're gonna head to a brewery right now that is close, um, Bog Iron Brewery. Brewery, and you can do seltzer or beer. <laughs> Really neither, I just snuck wine in. But chug vodka. Okay. <laughs> okay, we'll see you at the brewery. I feel like I was just here three seconds ago. Maybe not three, like three minutes ago. So I just got home from Oh my God, went to Patriot Place and then we went to a brewery, but to the breweries, all of the bathrooms like gave out <laughs> as soon as we were walking in. So we were able to order a drink each and then we had to keep it moving. Oh, I put a ton of dry shampoo in my hair. I promise I'm not going gray. I'm just trying to get prepared for dinner. We are going to dinner now with two couples, two Mexican. And then we invited everyone back to our house after to watch the fight. This should be interesting because I usually fall asleep like immediately as soon as the fights come on. So hopefully with some girlfriends over, I won't. So much tequila, so much tequila last night. Okay guys, we are getting ready to leave for lunch. This is the outfit that I decided to wear today. 